Chan's men were after me. They kinda are. I'm undercover in his game. Why were you in his office? I'm trying to find my dad, Chase. What? Like in a filing cabinet? No, no. I mean that just before he disappeared, he was seen getting into a limousine. One of Chan's? I think so. But the only stuff I found in Chan's office were empty money bags from Papalardo's. Papalardo's? Yeah, the ice cream place with the trucks, you know. Yeah. I remember. So if Chan's working for Vinny Papalardo's gang, is it Vinny that's working for Rex? Hey! Where are you going? Chan must be keeping my dad somewhere else! Stop! It's too risky! I'll find your dad! It's the least I can do! I am not gonna let you endanger my dad just so you can make up for the past! That's not! Why I wanna help you. This ain't the last you've seen of Moda Luca. I can do this sentence standing on my head. Thanks to my circus trainers. There's the paperwork. We won't be seeing Mo DeLuca back on the street for at least eight years. Thanks to those parking tickets. Another job done and the final day of my 36-year-long career finished. And all without a single blemish. Hey, Pat! I'm here for Mo DeLuca. <laughs> Vinny Papalardo ran the biggest gang in Lego City. And now, he wanted to see me. His ice cream parlor was a gathering place for local hoodlums. There was Tony one time. So called because he said everything once. Hey! Polly blindfolds. No, tell him I can't see him today. Lucky Pete. Good to see ya! Whoa! No! Hey! I found the penny! The crayfish twins. <gasps> Sorry! Wrong table. And Mikey spoilers. Check it out. When you get to the space center, you can knock down a planet from the ceiling to get a secret item. to make you laugh? You think I'm funny? Funny how? Uh, uh, uh I'm sorry, boss. I didn't Get mean to- Get out of here and unload that truck! <coughs> hey, you must be Chase. You come highly recommended. I won't forget what you did for my cousin. Oh, ignore the clothes, kid. It's my boy's birthday. I wanted to give him a nice surprise, you know? I've been looking forward to getting my hands on the stuff you got me for some time. They're called color guns, and they're of particular benefit to the less than legitimate fraternity. You know, us guys. Now, I need someone to see if these things really work by stealing the Bell Pepper Emerald from the Lego City Bank in downtown. You want to put one through its paces? Well, I've come this far. That's right. And don't worry about how to use it. I'll have a read through these instructions and phone them through to you. Good luck, Chasey. <laughs> I am going to have to shower for a week after this. This place. Sorry! I meant to have this place on Tuesdays, but the people listen to me? No! And they call this organized crime.
Whoa! Sheesh! That is one small step, Foreman. Perfect. While they're all busy working on the shuttle, I can just get to the moon buggy, which is somewhere around there. Uh, in the middle of the shuttle. Hey! That's my car! It's not your car! You are so possessive! Fine, it's our car, but it isn't his! Come on! Chance men better be waiting for me at the dock! There's Blackwell. I'm being abducted! Against my will! Can anyone hear me? P yeah, I can. I mean other than my abductors! We're here. <laughs> Mr. Blackwell, I, I am so relieved you're safe. I can barely sleep. Thank you again, Chase. You sleep during work hours? Well, uh, uh, let me take you inside. Thank you. Farewell, Chase McCain. I'm sure we will meet again. <laughs> oh, that rhyme. Where's my backup? You're meant to be here by now. Hey, Chase. Okay, Studsky and Clutch are here. Where's the lady in distress? Clutch, Studsky, thanks for this. Natalia's in Chan's salvage yard. The chief arrested some of his gang earlier, but he's still got a lot of heavies in there. Do you have a disguise for me? Do we ever? <laughs> that is perfect, Studsky. Really? They belong to our friend Huggy. He has no sense of personal space. Let's go rescue this girl. Come on! I'm gonna have to take these things off. Oh. Oh. He made me eat ice cream. Hold it! Oh. Studsky! Let's make ourselves scarce before the Chief shows up. See ya, Chase! Thanks, guys. And you've got to keep out of this, Natalia. I'll find your dad. I promise. I don't want to see you get hurt. Okay. Okay. Stay out of trouble. I will. Starting from now? Chase! Hey! Hi, Frank. What did you do to get sent out here, then? Are you sure you're a qualified plumber, honey? Of course! Ah. Honey! Nothing? That's right, deputy! Huh? I got you cornered! It's just you and me, Frank. Because I sent your a boss on a wild goose you go chase. The side. After wild goose. Say, oh, prayers. Oh, sorry. <laughs> hey there, Chase. We're just finishing rehearsing our play. <laughs> okay. You gotta do something to fill your days around here. Nothing exciting ever happens. I... uh... the front door was locked? <laughs> Calm down, Derek. Don't worry, you two. Your chief warned me you were coming, and I've drawn up a work roster. Frank, 
you'll be in charge of making sure we do not run out of coffee. You can trust me, Sheriff Huckleberry. And Chase. I broke the coffee machine. <laughs> Language! Well then, both of you will be rounding up Farmer Hayes' escaped pigs. His farm's to the south of here. I'd go myself, but it's curtains up tonight, and I still don't know all my lines. We're on it. Made me eat ice cream. Cold it! Oh. Studsky, let's make ourselves scarce before the chief shows up. See ya, Chase! Thanks, guys. And you've got to keep out of this, Natalia. I'll find your dad. I promise. I don't want to see you get hurt. Okay. Okay. Stay out of trouble. I will. Starting from now? Chase! Hey! Hi, Frank. What did you do to get sent out here, then? Are you sure you're a qualified plumber, honey? Of course! Ah. Honey! Nothing? That's right, deputy! Huh? I got you cornered! Huckleberry's in trouble. It's just you and me. Frank. Because I I'll sent your boss fight. on a wild goose you go chase. The side. After a wild oh. goose! Say. Oh. Prayers? Oh, sorry. <laughs> hey there, Chase. We're just finishing rehearsing our play. Okay. You gotta do something to fill your days around here. Nothing exciting ever happens. I... Uh... The front door was locked? <laughs> Calm down, Derek. Don't worry, you two. Your chief warned me you are coming, and I've drawn up a work roster. Frank. You'll be in charge of making sure we do not run out of coffee. You can trust me, Sheriff Huckleberry. And Chase. I broke the coffee machine. <laughs> Language! Well then, both of you will be rounding up Farmer Hayes' escaped pigs. His farm's to the south of here. I'd go myself. But it's curtains up tonight, and I still don't know all my lines. We're on it. Sir. Huh, at last! You have to find my pigs! And this is why I became a policeman. They're mountain pigs! Incredibly rare! I'm going out of my mind with worry! Going! <laughs> have no fear! This is Chase McCain! If anyone's qualified to find your pigs, it's him! Thank you, honey! Well, they shouldn't be too hard to find. It's not like they can fly. Oh, well, they're mountain pigs. They could be anywhere! Ah! Oh, oh, hi! Uh, I better stay here. In case they come back. Fine. I should be looking for Rex Fury. You'll need to look like a farmer, or they'll run off. I got some spare overalls and a hat you can borrow. Great. Thanks. I used to wear them to muck out the pigs. Oh. 
Then I locked them in a cupboard because they stinked up so bad. And I, well, buried the key in a field for safety. Right. And now they're haunted. Don't worry about this job, Chase. Consider a payback for how much the gift shop charged for that dinosaur pen when you were 11. Feathers. Four letters. Hmm. Hmm. Down? No, across. What? Okay, recruit, what is your name? Pete. Peterson, sir. Right, Pete Peterson. Being a fire officer is all about team effort. Team effort! Isn't that right, McGurkey? What? Don't help him. It means knowing what your fellow officer is thinking. What is my favorite flavor of cake, Pete Peterson? Uh, chocolate? Even the new recruit knows! Ah! Well then, Pete Peterson, we'd better start your training. What are you doing, man? I haven't given you any instructions yet! Sorry, I, I got a little excited. Fire extinguishers are not... Toys! They are not to be played with! Follow me over here. Whee! This is Officer Lopez Delgado. Hola! He'll give you your basic training. I've got to write a talk on the importance of buying the right flavor of birthday cake! What do you think that little joystick does? Don't know. Try moving it. Move! It don't do nothing. See? Move! Way! Ah, just leave it alone then. Whoa. So it looks like I know how to fly a helicopter then. And now I know that you have to switch off their engines after you land. I suppose I owe you an apology. I know you've been trying to protect me. I was just worried about my dad. And I know you didn't mean to reveal my identity during Rex's trial. Oh, right. So why have you been such a pain? Well, I still wasn't happy about it. When I first met you, I trusted you completely. I, I might have even had some feelings. So when you just left like that? Feelings? <laughs> Shut up. So, would you like to see a movie sometime? <laughs> you're actually kind of sweet, Chase. But you're married to your job, and I don't date married men. How about coffee? Just find my dad, Chase. Tea? A tiny cookie? Ice cream? Ice cream. Vinny's meeting with Rex. Please don't have left the restaurant yet. Hey, Chase. I figured this tunnel would look fancier, seeing as Blackwell's so rich. It ain't finished, is it? Blackwell lost interest in building stuff after the scandal. Oh, yeah. What was the deal with that? What? Have you been on holiday for the last few years? <sighs> Not quite. 
Blackwell was gonna build this massive apartment complex with a mall and everything up in Bluebell National Park. But then someone finds some sort of rare squirrel there, so City Hall stops it. By then, he'd already spent billions building Blackwell Bridge to connect the park to uptown. That must have been embarrassing for him. Oh yeah, he didn't take it kindly. Vowed he'd never build anything again. Right. Now, we gotta be quiet. Who are you? Uh... <coughs> Intruder escaping! Sentinels pursuing! him escape. What is going on in there? Oh, you guys are making a big mistake. When Rex finds out you did this. <laughs> Who do you think sent us? What? Why did he- I'm sorry. What's that? I can't hear you. Oops. <laughs> I broke the handle. <gasps> I said, why did <laughs> I gotta get Vinny out of there. What the- uh, Ow! That hurt. Hey, get me out of this thing, or Rex or- Rex ain't here! Why did he send you guys? I ain't telling you nothing. It's okay, Vinny. I think I know how to make him talk. Eat some more! Uh, oh yeah, that's mm, so delicious! Ow, ow, ow! Great freeze! Here comes the airplane! Mew. No! Stop! All right! I'll tell you anything! Where's Rex? I don't know. Honest, I don't. But I know how you can get to him. I'm meant to do some kind of job tonight in the construction yard at Paradise Sands. You could take my place. Y you kind of look like me. Hey, you are the same height. If you're lying... Don't worry, Chase. I'll keep him here. I got a few questions of my own I'd like answered. Yeah, no, no. Whoa, is that the blueberry and pomegranate ice cream? Oh, that stuff is amazing. Mm. Oh, wow, that is going straight to my hips. Mm. Can I get some sprinkles? Are you sure you turned the power off? Yeah. The light went red on the fuse box. Oh, by the way, my doctor told me I was colorblind this morning. Are <laughs> 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 you stupid? Somebody, get him to the chopper. I, I mean, hospital. Uh, now who's going to cover his shift? No, Not me. No uh, way. I've got plans. No. no way. How about me? You are plumbing a water main, not saving the world, Damkov. Uh, fine. You need a uniform. You, give him your clothes, your helmet, and your hammer. No, oh, it's okay. I'll find another one. Get out of the crane, Jimmy! 
Uh, uh, sure. Just give me a second. Hey there. Thanks. I gotta drive it up to the observatory. Stay here and see if anyone follows me. I get the feeling someone might try and infiltrate the gang tonight. No. Yeah! Oh. Grr. Meet me up there in ten minutes! Sure. Sure. <laughs> I am brilliant at disguises. Oh. All the days to leave my glasses at home! No. Oh. Just arrived. Uh... Excellent. All we need now is the password for the professor's device. I could soften him up. Uh... No need. My men have finally secured the leverage we have been pursuing. <laughs> um... <laughs> a boss. <laughs> Boss, your camera's at the wrong angle again. What? Botherations! <laughs> Technology! And it's making your voice go funny. Ah! I'll call you later. Professor? That must be Professor Kowalski. <laughs> How lucky was I to overhear that, eh? That's the truck the imposter was driving! Uh oh, I think my cover's blown. He's gotta be here somewhere. Find him. <sighs> that was close. <laughs> I hate you, elevator. help you Oh really No no <laughs> stop it no stop it I can't take any more <laughs> That's quite enough Rex my dear professor. Oh, hang on. Oh, the silly computer. My dear Professor Kowalski, please be reasonable. Forrest Blackwell! Forrest Blackwell? You lied to me. You said my research would benefit society. Oh, it will. Just not this society. The society which spurned my gift. The society which made me look like a fool when I offered them paradise. Building your monstrosity in Bluebell National Park would have caused a poisonous fallout. None of the wildlife would have survived. Oh, boo-hoo. Like we don't have enough squirrels. Go on. Do your worst. Professor. I would never hurt you. Dad! Oh, my Natalia! I've seen what they're planning! Don't! 
God help him! Off you go, my dear. I trust my intentions are clear. Yes, the password for the device is Forest Black Smell. Ah! Ah! Hmm. Looks like it works. Thank you, Professor Poe. This silly computer! Will somebody get me a new computer? What about my daughter? What about her? Oh, Natalia. What have I done? Whoa! Uh, room service? We are out! Oh, brilliant flying, pilot man! Oh, my bad. <laughs> Think you can open it? There you go. Well, I could have done that. Blackwell's mansion is huge. We should split up. Yes, good luck, Chase. Did you find Natalia? No, sorry. But it looks like I found Force Blackwell's secret. He's a model-making nerd. He is an evil genius. This is his plan. Look, this is my phase polarity and my magic bubble. He means to fly to the moon! How? The shuttle on Apollo Island isn't big enough for all his cronies. And you can't exactly hide a giant rocket in Lego City. The countdown! Blackwell Tower! Ellie, you have to get everyone away from Blackwell Tower. Now! Okay, but why? Blackwell Tower is a rocket. When it takes off, it'll fry everything within ten blocks. I'm sending you evidence. Right. Look, we don't have long, but we may be able to help. How? I'll tell you on the way. We've evacuated all the citizens. I hope you set up those things right, McCain. Me too. There's no way we'll get to a safe distance now, and I don't do well in the heat. I do. Honey, that rocket's flame is going to be burning at 3,000 degrees! That is hot! I better take off my jacket. How long do we have, Professor? Uh, about minus three seconds! to their computers, I saw that Natalia was on board! What?! That was... good work, Chase. He is talking to me, right? <laughs>